Paul, how many tickets had been sold for the three-game series? Well, I don't know exactly the number of tickets that have been sold, but I can tell you what we expected. Um, we expected a crowd of uh, crowds of 90,000 for the three games. I mean, that's what we budgeted for, and we did, we're, we're on pace for that, given what we had for last year. Um, we had three games against the Phillies last year. Um, would it be more than that with Doc here? Probably, if he was pitching. Um, you know, but you don't know whether he's even going to be pitching. Uh, what we do know is, uh, we have every reason to expect that he would have been in the building and we could have done what we wanted to do. Uh, but we were anticipating the same types of crowds as we had last year, and uh, maybe if Doc pitching, even a few more. Has there been any talk of any financial restitution for the games missed and what you might get from the Phillies? We have an arrangement with them, but I think at, uh, at the end of the day, we're hopeful to be revenue neutral. I mean, uh, we don't want to lose money on it, but at the same time, if we're playing these games and we're having, having uh, that type of crowd, uh, it will end up being a revenue-neutral situation. Uh, this was clearly not done for financial reasons. This was done more as an accommodation to everybody that's involved in A, the G20, and B, to our fans, who would have a difficult time getting here. I don't think there's any question as you look at what is, what, where, the, where the perimeter of the security is going to be, um, what's going to go on uh, downtown with the movement of, uh, of the various uh, dignitaries. I mean, this, this, is a, this is a big opportunity for, for this country to have the G20 here. Unfortunately, it just coincides with the worst weekend uh, that we could have with, uh, with the Phillies here. Paul, just to, to follow up on that, so just to confirm that you guys are, uh, are you on your normal gate receiving as far as uh, being the home team, or is this a different arrangement? No, we have a different, arra we have a different arrangement, but I mean, the, the goal was that we would end up to be revenue neutral. And it, it, this wasn't a negotiation. The, the, um, the Phillies are terrific people to deal with, and um, you know, we were fortunate that we were playing the Phillies at this time, so that when we sit down with Dave Montgomery or talk to Dave Montgomery, and I've had a number of conversations with him, starting back when it was first, uh, first announced, um, telling him that uh, uh, he's going to like uh, his team staying in, uh, in Welland. I mean, I, he put us in Conchahogan when we were there in the World Series. Um, so uh, we would, uh, he would have a problem with, uh, with the hotels and, and that type of thing. So we let him know then. But then as it became a little bit more definitive as to what was happening, uh, we, kept it, we kept him uh, informed as, what was as to what was happening. He's got costs of putting on the games. Um, and so, you know, we've worked out an arrangement that hopefully will make us both uh, revenue neutral. And just second to that, was there ever any consideration of having these games on a neutral site somewhere closer where, you know, it might benefit you to have maybe fans come down, or was that ever even considered? No, it really wasn't. It really wasn't considered. Um, you know, I guess that's, that was an option, uh, you know, whether we go to Cleveland, whether we go to Detroit, whether or not, you know, you go up to Ottawa, you play in, a, in, in, in one of those places. But I think at the, very, at the very conclusion of all of our deliberations, the easiest was, was just to go to Philadelphia. I mean, they were there. The, it's, there it's, it's obviously their home, home uh, stadium, but on the other hand, we are going to be playing American League rules. Uh, we're going to be uh, batting last, so uh, we just decided that it was better to do it there as opposed to uh, having both teams kind of be in neutral. Still a, dis still a distance recognizing that, but the two other alternatives, I guess, would have been Cleveland or Detroit, um, and, uh, you know, we had both been uh, visitors there.